happy Sunday. Today is February 7th, and we hope you have a blessed Sunday and are able to worship together with your family today. So today's passage is from Matthew chapter 11, verses 2 through 19. And the theme is, He is the Messiah. Who is that? It is Jesus. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I'm joined again today by Pastor E.J. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. And today, it talks about how John the Baptist is in prison, and he really wants to see Jesus because Jesus is the Messiah that all of Israel and all the whole world has been waiting for. And how do we know Jesus is the Messiah? Because he is the one that enables blind people to see, disabled people to walk, deaf people to hear, people with diseases to be healed. And he's preaching the good news, and he came to forgive us of our sins. How about you, Pastor EJ? Well, for me, verse 6 stood out to me. It says, Blessed is anyone who does not give up their faith because of me. Jesus said that because he's trying to encourage us to have faith. And we believe as a Christian that Jesus will come again as a second coming. Mm -hmm. So before the judgment day comes, let's wait with the hope and with faith. Yes, thank you. Very good. Uh, Thank you for sharing that, Pastor EJ. And we hope for you, uh, maybe there are people in your life that need to hear this good news as well. We want to encourage you. Uh, to share with them that Jesus is the Messiah, that He is our Lord and Savior. He is the one who can heal us and restore us, who can give us hope during this time, especially with the COVID-19 pandemic, where so many people are losing hope. They feel uncertain, feel depressed and discouraged about the future. But Jesus is the one who gives us hope to look forward to the future uh, when He will return again. So. Uh, yeah, we hope this passage is encouraging to you and a blessing to you as you meditate on it together with your family. And let's close to get, uh, this time in prayer. Uh, Father, we thank you uh, for just the revelation of your Son through your Word. And Lord Jesus, we thank you that you came to heal us of all our afflictions. You truly called us out of the darkness into your light. You helped us to hear your words, Lord, the words of the gospel, gospel of hope, Lord, so that now we are no longer living in darkness, Lord, but we are living as your disciples, living as children in the light. We pray, Lord, that the whole world can come to know, Lord, that you are Messiah. And we know that we have friends, family members, classmates, people in our workplace that may not know who you are. So we pray that we can share through our words, our actions, and our lifestyles that you are the Messiah, the Lord and Savior, and that you can give hope to people who need hope, that you can heal and restore us, and that you can help to give us live a life full of joy in you. So we thank you that we can experience you each and every day. And may we live and grow deeper into uh, and become more like you each and every single day. We pray all this in your most precious and holy name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, everyone. Have a blessed rest of the Sunday and hope to see you tomorrow.